Previously on the Hardy Boys. Open up! There's no escape, you two! We're 50 feet up! Just give up now! Better put some haste in your hack, Joe. I don't think that chair is gonna hold much longer. I'll do my job, you do yours. Just find us a way out of here. This must be safety glass. It isn't making this easy. Find something we can use as a rope. We break our necks jumping down from here. Got it. Crap! Don't move, boys! Mr. Ingalls would like a word. Endangering a pedestrian? Reckless driving? Running a red light? This really isn't anything to laugh about, boys. When your father and I agreed to get you both motorcycles, we set very strict conditions. Did you know that almost 50% of accidents involving motorcycles result in serious injuries? You can't afford to disregard the law. Mom, what are you talking about? We didn't... Officer Piedmont would like to speak to you boys. I don't know what to make of this. I really don't. I'm very disappointed in the both of you. Crap! Ah! Crap! Crap! Ah! Quiet, playback. Wow, you boys have really gotten yourself into some hot water now. You're wrong there. That water was freezing. What did we do? <clears throat> Under Article 418 of the Bayport Penal Code, I am hereby authorized to charge you both with violating the traffic code under Article 418 of the Bayport Penal Code. You're not really a police officer, are you? No, I work for the ATAC. I should have gone over my script a bit more. I'm, I'm just spouting out words here. I can tell. So you work for American Teens Against Crime too? What about the handshake? At least I remembered something, right? My name is actually Piedmont. Eric Piedmont, ATAC agent. ATAC agent! ATAC agent! <laughs> Quiet, playback. Couldn't you have come as a delivery guy or something? How are we gonna talk our way out of this one, Amal? We'll be lucky if we get to keep the bikes at all. Sorry, orders. We had to get this package to you immediately without any chance of it being intercepted. I can tell your mom I mistook you for someone else. No. That might make her suspicious. We'll take care of it. My apologies, boys. Sorry for disturbing you. That was so embarrassing. A police officer in our own house. Oh, it's a good thing he was young. It would have been worse if it was someone your father might have known. Mom, you don't understand. I'll tell you what I do understand. I understand that you won't be using your bikes at all today, and possibly for a long time. When your father gets home this evening, we can talk about exactly what your punishment will be. How are we gonna get out of this? We'll figure something out. Let's take a look at that disc. Perhaps another time. I'd love to watch TV, just not right now. I get the feeling I'm forgetting something.
perhaps another. That's my bed. No time for sleeping now. That's my bed. Perhaps another time. That's my bed. Perhaps an Yeah, I'd look I get the feeling I'm forgetting something.